you are here because you know exactly how I feel. You were putting things on your computer and you were editing or you were transferring stuff off your phone. And then all of a sudden, everything that you were working with just disappeared. You go into your recycle bin and it's not there. So what do you do? The other day I was taking some video uh, pictures and videos off of my phone. And I even went into the recently de deleted file on my iPhone and they weren't there either. So I was really in a dilemma and I, I had a couple things on there that I really wanted bad, that I really wanted badly. So I'm going to show you how I retrieved it and I am not techie. So I was pretty proud of myself for figuring this out after half a day, but I did it. And I, I did use a program. The link is below. I, it's not an affiliate program or anything like that. It was free. I found it, I used it, but I wanted to show you what I had to do to find my files because it's a little bit overwhelming. Once I downloaded this program or app onto my desktop, I allowed it to start scanning and it may take a few minutes to let it scan. It's gonna go into your hard drive and scan all your files. Now, it's very overwhelming when you look at it and I'm gonna show you, I didn't even scan everything, but you can see that it's gonna um, start showing you that there's all kinds of different videos, files, documents, and all that. And I'm it, again, it was very overwhelming. But once I got in and I got to this page here, I knew that I wanted a video. That's what I was looking for. What I did is I selected video on the side and you're gonna see how it's gonna update. So let it update, it's gonna take a few minutes. After that, I went up here into the search bar and I entered the date of the videos that I was looking for. That was the key that you need to do. If you have the date or some kind of a title where the search can locate it, that is golden. I knew the date. So all of my videos from this particular date showed up. Now, of course, as you can see, once it downloads, you still have these two sections um, to go through. I watch where I'm clicking. It's going to take about four or five clicks. And when you see your name, that is when you know you're in the right folder. Like I said, it's like four levels in and all the subfolders. Then it went to the folder that was on my desktop when I lost the videos. I had gone to a farm and I was videotaping some things and all of those <laughs> videotapes came off my phone onto the desktop and all of a sudden they were permanently deleted. I found them. Now here's another important factor. When you go to retrieve your videos, one, the scanning has stopped at the top. Two, you need to make sure you put them on a passport or some kind of an external hard drive because that was just recommended from the company that I got the app from. The link is below. Again, no affiliate link. It's free. I used it. Nothing's happened. My, my computer didn't ex explode or anything. In fact, it solved my problem. But once you take those videos or those documents, you put them on your hard drive, external drive, then you can retrieve them later after you um, turn, shut the program off and everything and then bring them back to your desktop. I hope this was helpful. Have a blessed day and um, go find those permanently deleted videos.